Hey guys, Hikans here with another World of Warcraft video. I had an insane week on the auction house, so I thought I'd make this video to share my numbers and then talk briefly about what I'm doing currently to make my gold. My guess is that it's been a perfect storm thanks to the WoW Remote Auction House API being down and there being lots more gold supply in the market from the tokens to balance future being live. On Wednesday afternoon, I came home from work to 424k worth of sales in my mail. On Thursday, I had about 200k worth of sales. Then Friday night before I went to bed, I had 259k in sales. Then the following morning on Saturday, I woke up to another 248k. Then I had another big day on Sunday, collecting about 450k from Saturday and Sunday sales. If you add all of that up, it ends up being a little under 1.6 million gold in sales in 5 days. I'm generally used to doing only about 2 million gold in sales per month, so that's a huge spike in sales. I haven't really been doing anything differently. A lot of my gold making is through flipping 101 BOEs. I did try and reset the Infernal Brimstone, Fellhide, Fellwort, and Starlight Rose market on my realm on Thursday, but the gold gain from that hasn't been substantial. Thanks to a lot more people buying tokens to sell for gold, and with the token prices being so high, I did sell two out of my four Minion of Grumpus mounts I farmed this past Wintervale for around 85k each. I also had about three days of people not listing Guard Night Howls, I think because the Remote Auction House API is down, where I was listing and selling them for around 12k each. On top of that, I've been doing a lot of various shuffles, mostly with Ysaraline Seeds, Stormscale, and Stonehide Leather. I probably moved close to 200 Obliterum this past week for around 2.5k each, and that's not including the ones I currently have on the Auction House. Lastly, I had three Dark Moon decks sell for over 100k each. This gold is definitely nice to have since I've probably spent close to 2.5 million now on WoW tokens to buy Overwatch, Overwatch crates, Hearthstone packs, and even WoW game time. I did manage to pick up some more tokens this past weekend to bring my balance back up to cap. A quick tip for anyone looking to buy a token with gold, or selling a token for gold, you can usually pick out a top or a bottom and a reversal in the price movement if the token price freezes for a while. The pause usually lasts for around 15-30 to 30 minutes, but I've seen it pause for hours sometimes. Anyways, I hope you guys had a great week on the auction house too. Let me know in the comments below if you've seen a similar surge in sales this past week. Either way, have an amazing Monday and I'll see you guys in the next video. Late.